What is going on guys and welcome back to another Minecraft starter house build. That's right, last time we did this and then I think that was the last one, right? No, the other one's over there somewhere. It's that one over there we did a couple months ago. We're gonna start a completely new one today. Yes, we are. We're gonna go Japanese style starter house. That's right, so we're gonna grab ourselves some cobblestone. As always, we're in, we're in 1.8. Is it 1.8 or 1.9? I can't remember. I can't, 1.9 we're in, 1.9. Yes, yes we are. So... We're going to place this right here. Boom. That's going to be the start of it. Maybe a little bit further. Now, let's just go there. Why not? Why not? One, two, three. Like that. And then one, two, three. One, two, three. That seem about right. Am I happy with that? You know what? I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. Three, four, five. Do I want to go five like that? That's like a real deep impression, isn't it? So, no, we're going to go three, man. We're going to go three. In fact, we're going to completely change all this. That's now five. We're going to go like that. I'm happier about that, if I'm honest. That looks better to me. So one, two, three, four, five. This is going to be um, five, six, seven. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we're going to go in five. One, two, one, two, three. One, two, three, 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 four, five. Is that kind of what we want? So it's seven all in all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right, and you kind of get what I mean. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 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 One, two. One, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Perfect. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There we go. So that's going to be the outline of this house. That's the way I want it to look. I think that's going to be beastly. So what we're going to do is we're going to add in windows right here. So we're going to go up to there. And, you know, as always, is it five that we did this one? I can't really remember. I can't remember what we do. One, two, three, four. I think it's five. So I think it looks something like that, don't it? So one, two, three, four. No, it's we go up five, don't we? So we got the the room for the roof. Yeah. So because like you know your your floor is gonna be like is the floor gonna be here? Maybe the floor is gonna be down one. You got the window and then you got enough there to do a roof. That's cool. That's cool. Right. So we're gonna take this up as well, like that, and take this up as well. Bring this across. And up like so, up like so. So we got this kind of thing going on, which I'm pretty happy with. Don't worry about it at the moment, guys. I know it looks a little, you know, a little plain. But you know what it's like with these starter houses. It needs to be, it needs to be well done. It needs to be sorted out. You know what I mean? So we got that there. Part of me thinks this bottom section should be lower. You know what? And part of me is right. I am damn right with this. Let's knock all that out. We're going to bring this lower. Because I want the up, the upper floors to be a little taller. That's why. I want I want the bo bottom floor to be a little squat. Right. Okay. And then we're also going to put windows in here too. Like so. We're not going to do the windows on the, where it comes in. I think that's the way we're going to do it. Like that. And then window here. Like so. Up. Up. Oh, up window there like so as well and then of course we're just gonna fill all this stuff in I know I could just like cut away and do all this off camera but I want to show you exactly like what's going on I think as if these are starter houses whether or not you've built something in Minecraft before or not built something in Minecraft everyone's built something in Minecraft before but you know what I mean whether you've built something uh, how do you how do you say like you know to the scale, I think that's kind of the words I'm looking for. Because you know what you like, you know what it's like with me. It's all the detail, all the time. And by all the time, I mean my builds take forever. But they're so worth it, man, they're so worth it. Let's bring that up, bring that up, bring that across. Yeah, like that, you're right, okay. Okay, now I see what's going on. And then I forgot to do this bit over here, because I was lazy and I was thinking about time lapsing it. And then the thing got the better of me, so I didn't. Yeah, this all needs to be filled in, don't it? I said, do that, do that, like that, right, okay, 
Good stuff. So what we're going to do is, for the time being, we are going to use... Uh, 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 uh. We're going to make the outside of it out of a caca wood. Where's the caca wood? The acacia wood. So for the time being, I feel like I feel like acacia wood looks really good. And we don't use acacia wood at all. Or do we want to use acacia wood? Yeah, bugger it. Let's just use acacia wood. So we're going to go all the way around this now with acacia wood like this. And this is going to be our floor level. So that's the upside of this floor. That's where this floor is going to sit. Like so, right? Do do do. So the only reason we're putting this down now, it'll probably change, but you'll never ever see this. This block here is just literally for reference for us. You'll never see it, but I want to do something that just in case it peeped out somewhere, it's going to fit in with the rest of it. Do I want to go acacia wood? I mean, is it going to look right? Is it going to look very orangey? I do not know. Ha, huh, that's something we're going to have to think about. So, now we need to work out what we're going to use for the next one. I am actually going to use... This is going to sound a little strange. I'm going to use sandstone. Because I feel like sandstone may be something you can get your hands on. And if we're using sandstone, we're going to change all this. We've got The rest of the wood we're going to use is going to be dark oak. Either Not dark oak, maybe spruce. Just so it, work, just so it looks a bit better. That's all. So, what I want to do is now, I want to look, kind of, I want to bring all this in one. So it gets slightly smaller on this one. So this is all going to come in one. I was thinking about coming in two, but in one is probably a better idea. So your upstairs is going to be one smaller than your in. Than your downstairs. What? What the hell am I saying, man? I've just spent the entire morning recording GTA videos with Zarius, so my entire, like, brain is just fried. The new the new DLC, the Cunning Stunts DLC dropped today. I know you guys are watching this a couple of weeks later, because I'm actually in the studio right now. And I recorded this last week, but my, my, brain, is, my brain is frayed. You saw those videos, you know what it was like. Freaking thing is insane. So that's what we got going on there, and then we're going to go up one... Two, three, four, five. This is where it's going to go up five. Like a mouse. And then, of course, we're going to go like this. And across there. I feel like a window there would be perfection. And then we're going to bring this across here, like so. And we are, in fact, going to do a cutaway here in a second. Because I want to just have a little look about how I'm going to want to break this down. So we'll do the front. And they're all going to be exactly the same all the way around. So, you know... Just get the front right, and then you'll be able to do the rest of it. Oh, come on now, man. Come on. Boosh, 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 boosh. Like that. So, I'm going to cut away, and it's going to look great. Skadoosh! There we go. So, I opted for, like, single uh, thingy windows on the side, but if you want to put the big windows in, you totally can. You totally can do that, man. You totally can do that. So, what I want to do right now is start bringing in some of this Japanese-ness. That's what we need to do. So we're going to say, we're going to do it in, with spruce, just because I feel like that acacia wood is just too, too similar. That's all. If you want to use acacia wood, go for it. You're more of a man than I am. I just think it just looks a little too, too close for comfort, you know what I mean? So we're going to grab some of this. Now, I want to work out how far I need this to go. So the question is, where do we want it to? We want this to kind of come to here. That's where I believe. So which means we need this to come out here like that. Which is not ideal. Let me just have a look now. I gotta work out these corners, man. I gotta work out these corners. So it needs to go like that. And then like that. Do we want it to drop down one more? That is the question. Which means if we do that, we can kind of go like that. And then just drop those down. Have them all come around like so. Which actually don't look too bad. But then again, just the one is kind of nice. You know, which means we do, in fact, then have to change all this acacia wood. Which I mean, isn't the end of the world, right? It's not the end of the world. But I did kind of want it to come down one more, if I'm honest. 
like usually I do it all out of you know if usually right if I was building a Japanese house I'd have it like this you know what I mean I'd have it like that but then that's just not good enough that's not good enough and I'm not okay with that so what we're gonna do is what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the same slanted like I said before and we are gonna drop it down like this this entire second row here is going to be oh not those full logs why because this bottom row is going to be half slabs once more like that and it's going to look like that so it's going to stick out quite a bit at the bottom but that's cool that's going to give us depth that's going to make it look really cool because we're going to have an archway that goes across here so i'm okay with that so what you want to do is go all the way around with these which is going to hide the mistake of the acacia wood which I'm all cool with hiding mistakes, man. I'm, I'm totally okay with that. You know what I mean? Some mistakes are easier to hide than they are to fix. So lesson for, there's a life lesson right there for you. Some mistakes are easier to hide than they are to fix. Skadoosh. Along here. Oh. Along here. Oh, we're not going to do the inside there because I need to change that into... Something else. And then we're going to go all the way along here. Needs all this stuff. Like so. So you're starting to get the Japanese stylings on it, right? But it's not, you know, I didn't want to go for the, the traditional, oh look, I've stacked a couple of things on top of each other, a couple of squares on top of each other and made some curly corners. Look, I have a Japanese house. This is I wanted this to be really, really like functional, so you got a lot of space on the inside. Which for me is is odd saying. Because usually I'm all about the exterior and I'm like, I'll worry about the middle and, and in the end, you know? I worry about how the hell I'm going to be able to fit my stuff in here at the very end of it, so but at this point I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that and I'm not okay with that. You know what I mean? Right. Here, I want to change, so we are going to have to change these acacia bits here. Which is okay. And then here, I'm going to want to go like this. Boosh. Boosh. And the same here. Boosh. So, oh, there we go. It's not a Jester Wish video unless it rains, man. If you see a Jester Wish video go up and it doesn't rain, then it's clearly something's gone wrong. And you should notify the, the correct authorities straight away. Mm-hmm. You heard it here first, folks. You heard it here first. And then we're just literally going to bring this in like so like so bring your extended around like that and like so like so on that too like that and you know in fact yeah let's leave it like that I kind of like the way that looks and then underneath here, just fill it all in as you usually would. So we are going to have to change this acacia wood here as well. So there's a few little bits we have to change. And in fact, I'm going to fill all that in there. But I mean, at the end of the day, we got away with a lot of it. And we'll worry about how that looks underneath in a later video. Because that looks good to me. And then on these corners, you saw what I did. I went like this. And I do kind of like that. And then you'd have to go like that. To give it that. So I'm going to do those on the corners. Which I kind of like. Let's try that again. So you'd go boosh, 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 boosh. You know? That's got some Japanese-ness to it, if you ask me. So what was it? Boosh, 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 boosh. And just reattach that. And again here. Skadoosh. Skadoosh, skoosh, 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 boosh, boosh, boosh. There we go. So we got some real Japanese style awesomeness going along. This here, I want to bring this down right here. Because we're going to do this on most of the corners, in fact. I need to be able to... I'll worry about that in a second. 
on these corners, bring down your um, supports. Because, I mean, those corners overhang quite a lot without supports on them, man. So, there's a little trick. You know, most people wouldn't do that. And then you'd be like, there'd be something off and you wouldn't be able to work out what the hell it is. That's what it is. And I'm half tempted to go around it like this. You know what I mean? I think that would look pretty cool, actually. Would add something, wouldn't it? Ah, god damn it, Cage. You know? If we go all the way around it like this. I'm not worrying about the insides, like these inside walls at the moment. Because I don't know whether they'd have them. And if they would, it would be slightly different styling to it. And I just really can't be bothered at the momento. So we'll have a look and see what we can do with those. Oh, let's put them here as well because they do kind of need it here, don't they? Oh, wrong button. Well, c come on now, man. Come, come on. Like that. So you get that from underneath, which actually looks pretty damn sexy. Let me check see how long we've been recording for. Smashing stuff, about 16 minutes, which is awesome, which means we can full on pull the next Sekashione up and get it going. So, this next section here. So, once again, once again, this here, we, there will be another gap up. You know what I mean? There's going to be another one. And this top one here, I'm thinking, I don't know what I want to do about it. So, let's have a look. Let's have a freaking look. So we are going to run a band of oak wood all the way around. Because this is going to help. Because I want to put a balcony at the top here. I want a balcony that goes pretty much all the way around on all the corners. Not on the little bits that jut in, just all the corners. So around here like so. Remember now we only got a couple minutes to get this somewhat sorted. Boosh, boosh. Get that through, get that through. Bam. Right, now. Now we're going to do this all the way around too. And this is going to be what we're going to sit the... The, um... What's it called? What the hell is it called? I don't know what it's called. I completely forgot what it's called. And it's not going to go all the way around. We're going to, like, delete some of this in the middle, but I don't know how it's going to go. So, if you are building this in survival and you're building along with me, maybe not do this little section or this little step right yet. Just see how it turns out, first of all. Because I am going to be deleting some of these stairs. I just don't know which ones yet. I just don't know which ones, man. It's getting dark. It's getting way too dark to see. Boosh! Right. Now, what we need to do is we need to grab ourselves some of the trap doors. Like that. Biggest question, what are we going to do in these corners? I know what we could do. We could just grab. I know that sounds like a massive kind of cheat. Yes, these ones here. These ones right in the middle there. Get rid of them. We don't need them. Because we're not put in. We ain't putting things. Wrong ones. So, go all the way around. Add these in. Remember, you can only do this in 1.9. But if you haven't got 1.9, just use fences, man. Fences will look just as good. Believe me. Believe me. I'm a doctor. Fences will look just as good. Again, don't know, really know what we're doing in those corners. So, we're just, at the moment, adding in these corners here. Mm -mm, douche, douche, douche. And let's just go all the way around and then we can flick them back up, huh? Unless we accidentally... I mucked that one up tonight. That needs to go there. So we need to do these facing outwards. Otherwise, they won't open the right way. Hence why I'm flying around the place rather than just standing in one place and placing them all. That was a lot of places, man. That was I, I said a lot of the word place. Boosh, boosh, boosh. See, that one's wrong there, because I wasn't facing the right direction. 
All these should be good, though. Yeah, that one's wrong. Not anymore. Right, from down here, that looks pretty good. But we are going to have to end this episode there, guys. If you're liking how it's turning out, please, as always, high-five that like button for me. It means a hell of a lot. And I shall see you in the next video for another one of these Japanese-style starter houses. I shall see you in the next video. See ya, see ya, see ya, guys.